Alright. We are on. Alrighty. Music by Ryan Roth. Alright, so like I said, we're gonna pass controllers around. Who wants to be who? I don't wanna be the chick with the big titties. You can be any of these four people. Man, I don't wanna be ancient art. <laughs> He's ancient art. <laughs> oh, ancient art. Um oh, oh. Just Down there, it. that bottom one. That one with the four tits off the face. That's a dude. Yeah, him. <laughs> Alright. You want Mr. Double Ocean? Okay. No, he's got like four tits. Oh, you're that's you're being green. Who are you, Tim? I'm gonna be the top one. Alright. I'm gonna so be so I strong. get one of the girls. It be her because she's got a cooler hat. Alright. Oh, 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 yeah. You the black chick out of it. I see how it is. Do, 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 do. We all could be here in six weeks and no one expects it. Not a one of us. We just keep on living our lives week by week, unaware. No metagaming. All right. So speak for yourself. Yeah, this is me. I I get to pick first. So okay. here's, here's how it works, basically. Your stats will be up here. Uh huh. They don't matter all that much. The It'll change based on stuff that happens. Do you okay. mean the top right? Or? Yeah, that's where I'm pointing. That's why I said but, top right. And then basically, yeah. you choose where you want to go in town over here. To the. And that's then the when you go to one, to the left. and you when you go there, yeah. stuff something will happen. And we okay. just keep doing this until the game's done. So when, huh? when, when, when does the turn end? Um, after everybody goes once, basically. Ah. Oh, okay, so you choose one place then. The turn. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna go to. It's good you're stuck because we don't go to the house. And I will do administration. Well, that's not good at all. You spend yeah, the ten those balls for the palace. <laughs> you're paid two wealth and gain one mind. One day you accidentally bump into a duke. Mm -hmm. Watch where you're going, filthy peasant. Mm -hmm. He shows you out of the way with his hand and continues walking. I want to be the duke. Mm. Yay, peasant oh. The outfit looks really comfortable. He looks mildly insulted. Sick burn. <laughs> you gain one charm. All right, Ian. Yes. Yeah, Where can I get a drink? Is that there you can drink in this game? There is a tavern. Is that the big building what? with the brown roof? You mean this one? Yeah. They probably uh, overcharge you. I'm going to the slums. Alright. <laughs> what are you going to do? Fight crime or pickpocket? I am the knight! <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> Alright. I should note too. Oh, you're drunk. supposed to read it. Yeah, you're supposed to read um, it. I do stuff. I do the thing that's down there. I'm illiterate. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> One night, I hear cheetahs coming from the islands. <laughs> and then. I pee in them, and then you see a crowd of men cheering on doggies, vi ripping each other apart. Not sure if you're serious or what. <laughs> One of the- actually, I should probably scoot for a second, it's better. Oh, that's why you're making yeah. shit oh. up. One of the men test. spots you ask. Oi! What are you talking about this about? I don't know bet, I don't know what he's trying to say, so I'm going to bet on dog fights. Oh, oh no! You try to bet on the fights, but you actually don't have any money to do so. You still watch, however, enjoying the carnage of dogs ripping each other apart. The city slumbers. Right. That's pretty gruesome. <laughs> no, I thought you were fighting crime. I don't know if we can go to the same place. I, I think, I, think like I just went from out. Batman to Mary Poppins to fucking uh, Watchmen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I don't think I go. Yeah, okay, so we can't go to the same place. Nope. Let's clean the lab for me. Guy. You spend the week cleaning up noxious chemicals. You're paid one wealth for your labor and gain one physique and one magic. One day you hear when the alchemist shouts, Eureka! And you look over to Thank see you. what he's done. You smell small, previously dead fat. Come to life. I figured out the antidote to death. The alchemist explains. The undead ferret lets out a horrific noise. And lovers are about slowly uh oh. Um <laughs> Good job, bro! <laughs> Way to make zombies. <laughs> uh, I need a brown nose. <laughs> That's amazing, you say. Well uh, slightly discovered by a fair presence. You didn't hurt the alchemist. Congratulations, feelings. you passed Barney's test. You <laughs> can't have a charm. Alright. Say the last time it came, the yog devoured houses whole, stole lives, tore families and family members apart. <laughs> that was so very long ago. Uh, Good thing that happened a long time ago, not now. We go to the bar and drink more. I, I'm gonna go to the palace again. Damn it! This time, I'm gonna attend a ball. But you're a filthy peasant. 
She's attending some balls. I spend the week attending fancy oh. gatherings. Oh, that's for being too charming. One finesse. One day, you decide to lean up against the wall just to take a break. Oh. It rotates as you apply pressure and you stumble down a set of stairs. You enter a large dusty room filled with barrels. Barrel! You found the king's famous wine cellar. Uh, it's all mine? <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> the story you have a secret hide is so exciting. You know I'm gonna charm in one mind. I wouldn't explain it either, because you know, yes. guards be all like, hey, you're stealing the king's wine. Time <laughs> to rest. There's there some rumors in the slums that there's some wine. <laughs> <laughs> you can't go to this. So. Really? Yeah. Or go somewhere else next week if you want to go to the palace of that. Go to the tavern. Get drunk. I can. But I don't have money yet. You saw that. That's true. Oh man, Arena. Uh oh. Arena. I might have to make cat calls at hot athletes. So if you can fight him, bet on the fight. You don't have money, bro. He's got physique. He might be able to fight. Oh shit. You spend the week fighting brutes in the arena. You gain two physique and one finesse. Oh, you're getting strong. While wandering around the halls between matches, you spot your former lover, Kelly! <laughs> <laughs> An awkward exchange happens in which you want to know. How they're doing without seeming to care too much. I don't care. After a few minutes, Gene, one of the most popular fighters in the arena, butts into the conversation. Hey, Kelly. Sorry to interrupt, but we got to leave right away. If we want to make it to your mother's in time. Uh oh. Thank you. you say an awkward goodbye as they walk off holding anyway. hands. <laughs> How do you feel? I feel happy for Kelly. Extremely jealous. Yeah. I, I, I don't feel extremely jealous. <laughs> he yawned dairies. You become extremely grumpy for the rest of the week. You lose oh. charm. Oh, you're no fun to be around. You channel your rage into working out. Yeah! Oh, that's so strong. <laughs> I am the knight! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I am the knight. <laughs> uh, Alright. You know, with that, with that zombie outbreak, I think she would have lost me. Alright. Let's tend to the patients. You spend a week diagnosing and tending to the sick. You gain two mind and then one will. One day, the bloodletting leeches somehow escape from their containers. Leeches start flooding into the hallway. Now people screaming everywhere as leeches slither towards them. Somebody do something, yells one of the doctors. It's... It's just leeches. Bait yourself! <laughs> no, I'll get a leaker from Alright. Just kill them. You make your hand unleashing a wave of magic to slam it and you just go. Oh. <laughs> your magic ability isn't what you thought it was. The oh. spell fizzles out before even reaches the leeches. Regardless, the leeches make their way out of the hospital and end up investing all of the nearby ones. <laughs> it was honest in a heartbeat, so the stories go. The earth shook, the air went still. I'm gonna go. Forest. Sorry about your waterways. I'm gonna chop it. I spend the week cutting down trees for the village. Gain two physique and earn yourself one wealth. One day you stumble upon a dryad picking flowers in a field. Chopper dance. Upon noticing you, she runs up to you excitedly. Excuse me, miss, would you care to dance? She asks. Hi. I've been wanting to dance for so long, but nobody ever nobody else has been around to dance with me. She air quote, says. dance, air quote. Uh I Fucks this dance there. Ah. She giggles and takes you by the hand. She starts humming. <laughs> she starts humming on a song. <laughs> and the two of you dance together in the middle of the forest. You accidentally step on her toes several times while dancing. After the third time, she stops you. She thanks you for the dance and limps up <laughs> into the night. You practice dancing a little. Gain one finesse. Alright. Yeah. Okay. What's uh what's my score? It's on the right there. there. Yeah. Those are your stats. Yeah. So I don't have bad finesse. I just have zero wealth. Right. I have some wealth. Too busy beating people up. <laughs> you can go to the bar and start a fight. No. I'm gonna go to the gardens. What? <laughs> and landscape the shit out of it. <laughs> oh god, how good he is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Well, yeah! Aw, oh, son of a bitch! You didn't read what happened. <laughs> toss him a sack of coins. <laughs> like one that. coin? I <laughs> toss him a sack of one wealth. A sack of coin containing one wealth. <laughs> Spot him eating what looks like a fresh roasted chicken. Oh, that's awesome. Bitch. 
See if you can smile with a toothless grin. Okay, never mind. Never mind. You feel good about yourself. I feel good. Okay. It, I can't not gain physique, man. I wow. went to the garden. Wow, you got a lot. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Wow, that, that was a payoff. Nope. It's like, don't give him the coin. You beat him up. <laughs> <laughs> You spend the week attending the fans of Gavin. You gain two charm and one less. One day the king approaches you. Excuse me, but you look like someone who I can confide in. He says, He's gay! <laughs> You'll get me in. I really want a prince to take over the throne, but the queen and I aren't exactly active in the bedroom. He blushes a little. Told you! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Do you have any advice on how I could? Romance the queen, so to speak. Oh, now you want me to be Let me teach you the ways of my people. Teach the king your ways? Maybe you don't know how to help. He wants you to teach uh, him how to kiss. Sorry, I'm a sexless robot. <laughs> <laughs> I got some pretty good charm. I'm almost tense. I'm gonna try. Actually, you do have a lot of charm. What, what, what do we mean charm? Sex is all about uh, physique and de finesse and magic. But I have some wealth. Well, I'm like you, peon. You spend hours drawing a bunch of oak. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, God, you drew him pictures. <laughs> no. You drew him dirty pictures. <laughs> I'm excited, man. Let's go through the scenarios with the king. By the end of it, he's just as charming as you are. So looking at oh, porn <laughs> helps you develop charm. Yes. He thanks you and your... Oh, and, uh, he thanks you and hands you a large sack of coins as a reward. You're getting pretty well. Man, things get all rich. <laughs> Later that night, you get the sinking feeling that you might have actually made things worse. Uh-oh. What? <laughs> Why then the I... world was a howling fury, chaos screaming, the sound of all we know being pulled in half. <laughs> the king has failed his charm! <laughs> uh... I'll go to the hospital this time. I'm gonna clean up. Clean up your mess. Let's clean up your mess. Okay. Spend the week stealing your mind against the horrors of the hospital, making sure it's as clean as it can be. Gain one mind, one physique, and earn one wealth. One day, a patient whose voice has been cursed and replaced with piano notes won't stop talking. The other patients are complaining that his voice is making the hospital even more depressing. The doctors have tried convincing him to stop talking, but to no avail. You know, I'm charming. If that has anything to do with singing, let's try it. Start trying to sing along with his voice. And then you end up stepping on his toes. Three you times. start singing wonderful melodies together, making everybody happy. Bah! One of the doctors slips you a sack of coins to thank you. Oh! You gained too well. <laughs> hey, you guys. It's not all you slipped me. Oh, <laughs> 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 well, you are a woman. <laughs> That's why the king didn't confide in me. Mm. I don't see how I make them work. Oh, I can bartend. Apparently. You can live here. You can make some wealth. I spend the week serving drinks at the tavern. You earn one wealth and tips and gain two charm. Hmm. One day while in the tavern, you hear a large commotion outside. Fuck that. Wait, 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 whoa, whoa. If you go outside, you might get rough. I'm going outside, I don't give a fuck. You are the knight! You see a crowd of angry people carrying torches and poach for so uh -oh. Kill the dryad! They <laughs> chant in sort of synchronized cat oh. They are all running to the middle of town. Working your way through the mob, you find a dryad running away. I was just looking for someone to dance with. She sobs. No, I was stepping on my toes. You shout at the top of your lungs for the crowd to stop what they're doing. Your words fall on deaf ears. They fall on deaf ears. But what about deaf fists? <laughs> <laughs> you see the dryad get set on fire in front of a pitchfork. Oh. Um. You're no longer the knight. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't think one. there's the right word. More like, um, okay. <laughs> it's more like... Oh no. <laughs> oh no. It's burning. Oh, my. Yep. Uh, Dirty whores trying to dance with everyone in town, probably. That's right, justify it. <laughs> you feel better about your, sac your failure. So. We spend the week experimenting with different potions. No, hey, potions hey. might make the zombies fly. I don't want to hear it, Jordy. <laughs> You're the one who crippled her feet and didn't let her get away. <laughs> <laughs> You came to magic on the line. One day, while you're at the tower, one of us asks you to watch his potion while he's out. Soon after he leaves, the potion begins bubbling out of control. 
Don't do something soon, it'll explode. <laughs> Why would I drink it? Hide <laughs> the evidence. Oh, what? No comment. I can either throw it out the window or drink it. What's it gonna be, Tim? Don't be a pussy! <laughs> it might be alcohol. Drink, 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 drink. Choke, 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 choke. Oh, Like, it could be really, really good. Because I see myself throwing it out the window and hitting someone and losing hey, some charm. Yeah, this way. He drinks it and becomes a yaw. You might get superpowers. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Oh. It, it might be like you lose, like, two physique. You throw up and you lose physique. <laughs> Magic mind charm. Like, it might give me stats and take away stats, which won't bother Stop me too Stop thinking! Much. What is this, college? You're right. Just drink it! <laughs> It is college! <laughs> <laughs> you quickly drink the potion. You said something you can't seem to handle a uh, fire erupts from your soft esophagus. From a solid minute, you're shooting out jets of fire from between See, your lips. You became a dragon! That burns. <laughs> you lose two to see. I figured. <laughs> what a learning oh, experience, experience, though. You gained one in mind. That's okay. I can do some. It's got smarter. Oh, I didn't get to read that. Sorry. That's, that's fine. fine. I hit it. Uh, that's fine, because I'm trying to go for a smart Z guy anyway. Go back to Palace. Time Spend the week attending it. fancy gatherings. You gain two charm and one finesse. One day the court jester approaches you. Uh-oh. Would you like to learn to juggle? He asks excitedly. I'll teach you everything I know for a small <laughs> sum. You have money. Yeah, why not? Spend the day with the jester practicing your juggling technique. You improve dramatically. You gain two finesse. Nice. You gain another two finesse. Oh, wow. And happily pay the jester for his services. You lose one wealth. Fuck your finesse. That was worth it. Hey, you're the strong one. Yeah, I want some finesse in this. Yeah, man. Can we have some? Like, you can't do it at the same place. Why can't I move off? You can do the bar again. The music's all, like, getting more dramatic. I came here. I know. Ah, fuck. the night. I am the night. <laughs> <laughs> Gain one mind, one physique, one physicist. One day you notice a man drawing water out of a well. Suddenly, leeches <laughs> begin pouring out of the well and covering the man from head to toe. <laughs> That's my <laughs> problem. People, what in the air do or do this? <laughs> they start making their way towards you too. What do you do? Blast them with magic. Lure the leeches back into the well. Kill them. Kill them all. Oh, time to lure them back to the well. <laughs> you start taunting them, the leeches. You stupid leeches. Are you going to crawl and suck my blood? With great skill, you manage to avoid the leech's fangs, and then you lure them back into the well. Quick thinking, you gain one mind. Oh yeah. No, that's working. Um, let's clean up my mess because it's probably a bunch of scorch marks. You like, spent a week cleaning it. up noxious chemicals. You only paid one wealth for your labor and gained one physique and one magic. One day, and. Artificer stops by for a visit. She is adorned with magical gadgets and gizmos. And is followed everywhere by her clockwork spider. The alchemists of the tower all go to their way to impress the artificer, offering her an array of potions and elixirs. However, as she leaves, she turns to you and says, You, I like you. I like you, you too. too. <laughs> she offers you a choice of one of her trinkets. Choose oh. the vagina. Oh, damn it. Clever thoughts. Swift motion. I will take the clever thoughts. Thank you very much. The ring grants you to be mine. The alchemists are jealous. Probably because I did my job. Yug is almost here. Almost. Almost. I like that. I got exactly what I want. <laughs> oh, sorry. I can't loop it. I gotta go up or down. Uh, Does anyone else need to go to the towers? <laughs> I don't care where I go, really. I'm just picking places, see them in, go to the gardens. I'm gonna meditate. Uh, uh, spend the week in deep meditation. Gain one magic and two minds. You wasted one week. <laughs> one day you spot a man drinking water from out of a pond. Then leeches! Suddenly he screams! <laughs> you look over to find him covered in leeches! <laughs> Son of a bitch, Tim! <laughs> oh my goodness! God, Tim, this is never ending. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, get out of there! <laughs> you make a break for it, you get to safety. 
You go by the well water later in the night to find only a pile of bones. Oh, jeez! Good job! I don't have any magic, man. Your mind was ten, man. No, it was magic. just six. No, it was ten. It was six. Magic yeah. is its own stat. Yeah. Oh. My magic was six. And that wasn't enough for Tim to zap those leeches. I, I have to alert them of the leeches. <laughs> Why couldn't I lure them back into the pond? You said the week didn't pay over. Why aren't you talking? Ian. Ian. What? You're supposed to read it. I was I I was thinking. It was internal. Re read it out loud. I'm gonna try to figure out what this fucking joke is, cause I feel stupid not knowing what it is. Ha! Ah, I got it. Several hours later, I figured it out. Wow, you had the last laugh. All that thinking gave your mind a workout. One mind. Um, Alright, that's it. Oh. Uh, that, that, that I think you can need to go back. That was me. Oh, you didn't want to go there? Yeah. Uh, I thought I messed up. Yeah, it's blue. Blue. Spent a week experimenting with different potions and brews to gain two magic one mind. One day you hear cries for help coming from the next room. Running over to investigate, you see that the alchemists there have accidentally created an ooze monster. How will you dispatch of the ooze? Punch it the switch. I don't have it. I just anyway. love that that's an option. <laughs> I'm actually over ten magic, so I might actually be able to do something now. Nice, you pulverize the ooze into a puddle with an array of magical spells. The alchemists all cheer. You gain one charm. Uh oh. The storm arrives in the night. By the morning, it still rages. For three full days, the tempest puts us through a grinder, drowns us, crushes us, ruins us. But then it ends. You see the graveyard our home has become. Our home. Does anything yet live? Is it? Are we past saving? Oh my. Yeah, so now we gotta choose roles. What? And basically, how this part works is choose what you think you'd be useful for or good at. The town. And helping drunk. the town. <laughs> and helping the town? Or you, you know, or you could just be a looter or a drunk. Um, but that helps the town, right? No. That only helps yourself. And you can't be the looter. You're the knight. You are Batman. I am the knight. Yeah. I'm going to be the tailor. That's it. You volunteer to weave and mend clothing for the survivors to keep warm. Nice bucket of skulls there. <laughs> <laughs> you make and mend clothing faster than anyone would have ever expected. Good. Every survivor now has an excess number of scarves, socks, and hats to keep warm. Well done. This helps the survival effort immensely. All right, Ian. All right. What are you gonna do? You got a lot of. Well, I'm going to be the leader, and I'll run on the "We must get rid of leeches" platform. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I will establish a leech eradication wait, 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 wait. task force. <laughs> Ian, you you have a lot of finesse and strength, so you might be better as a smelter or a builder. Fuck you! <laughs> you take it upon yourself to be the leader of the I don't like the way this picture's going on. Right <laughs> you try to delegate tasks, but can't get many to listen. You try to give congratulations to hard workers, but your words come across to insincere. You help the rebuilding effort a little bit. Yeah! A little bit! What? <laughs> Was it negative? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty high in mind, so I should probably be the leader, but you block that off. Fine, pick it. You got mind and magic. I can't, you already picked it. Can't you got some charm and wealth too. Do what you want. Um, why can't you pick the leader too? We because all pick you, one role. Oh. It's just like the building. Well, there can't be two leaders. Yeah. Then what is this? We would have what is this? A democracy? <laughs> we, we, we would have infighting. Um, also, doesn't that house kind of look like a dog? Mm, With the nose and you, eyes. You mean the, the castle? Yeah. No. Oh, <laughs> no one sees it? Yes. Uh, That's sad. Let's see, I got a lot of magic, a lot of mind. <laughs> I got some wealth. So, the looter? <laughs> No, I would die. <laughs> I want more of them. I only have eight. Hmm, or I six. Could conjure or the doctor. That would be best suited for me. Tim, just pick the thing with the blasty stuff. So the conjurer. Yes. <laughs> okay. <sighs> you take it upon himself to help conjure up supplies from the town. I think magic be somewhat larger amounts of supplies. With some effort, you summon them all than enough lumber and food for the town. Excellent. This helps me building the effort a lot. Oh, here's our ending. I think. And so we set about our tasks, once more living our lives, this time in a way we might never have expected, or even wanted. But in the end, it was a struggle, but a struggle we never abandoned. Though our home had been stripped apart, we did not let it languish, and whether we succeeded or failed, we did our best. Who knows if the Og will visit us again? Who knows if we, if we will ever be, can ever be, ready for it? 
I should have later. I had a lot of chum. I would have done stuff. So I won, right? <laughs> no, you, you. I think we get a little like. Yeah. You dragged us down. <laughs> well, the town's being rebuilt. You go into the hospital to retake your role as custodian. Your job isn't glamorous, but you make it. Ah, you make it better by poking fun. Yeah, but poking fun of the doctors with witty one-liners. You often have a clever retort to your jokes, and the back and forth is well paced and punchy. Hmm. One day, a patient, also a playwright, asks for permission to write about write a play about your life. You happily accept. The play becomes an instant hit, and you become a celebrity for a brief moment in time. Hmm. You still clean up blood and vomit for a living, however. <laughs> and then, Ian. <sighs> you have to read that. My life after the y'all was uneventful. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> You work, you get married, you adopt a child, you take care of that child, you get old, you retire. But you never die. Immortal! <laughs> you go on vacation for a few years, you get too old to be independent, so your child takes care of you. You die. Now you die. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. Unfulfilling. The odd changed you, probably for the better. With the town being rebuilt, you eventually decide to retake your role as doctor of the hospital. Ah, so we're the ones that are just exchanging quips. I see. There, you make a friend with another doctor. The two of you do everything together. You're inseparable. Yay. Eventually, you even decide to, to, to get an apartment and live with each other. Then your friend gets married and everything changes. Their spouse has to move away to a new town and your friend follows. You're trying to keep your heart <laughs> But the letters start to come less and less frequently. You try to fraternize with the other doctors. While they're all nice people, nothing can compare. Yeah, but they're some kind of like things. <laughs> just kind of. Alright. <laughs> so, the town didn't get destroyed. Some of us didn't have overly awesome endings, so. I'm sorry, Tim. I should have been leader! <laughs> you should have been leader! <laughs> it's the leeches. <laughs> they never let you forget about them. <laughs> you saw what they did to the town! Yeah, the one guy turned to bones. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> 